Today on CCX News, big impact. What we're hearing from local hotels as Minneapolis plays host to the Big Ten women's and men's basketball tournaments. A disappointing winter ended the Maple Grove Ice Castles attraction after only a week's run. But there's hope this spring for tourism dollars. I spoke with local tourism officials who hope to cash in on major sporting events coming to the Twin Cities. March Madness is here as fans descend upon the Twin Cities for Big Ten tournament basketball. Yet the excitement isn't centered entirely around the Target Center, roughly 18 miles away. We're happy to welcome them. Staff at the Cambria Hotel in Maple Grove have Big Ten tournament brackets and signage proudly on display. We have those sports fans that may not want to be in downtown, but want to be here, and Maple Grove's the place to be. Cambria's sales and marketing director, Diane Ochterkirk, says the hotel is perfectly situated along I-94 near plenty of bars and restaurants. If you don't want to stay downtown, we've got, we've got everything you need without being downtown. She can't say for certain how many guests are here for the Big Ten tournament, but they're doing their best to cater to the ones who are. We want to have the women's games and the men's games on TV for them to watch and enjoy. The hotel works closely with the local tourism organization Experience Maple Grove to promote the area. And Dr. Kirk's hope is that as more major events come to downtown Minneapolis, folks will be willing to make the 20-minute drive to stay in one of the 129 rooms here. Throughout the entire summer, you've got these large soccer tournaments, and then you've got USA Volleyball downtown, and don't forget uh, the USA Gymnastics Olympic Trials. So we'll see some folks. The next opportunity to see those folks will be next week when the Big Ten's men's tournament comes to town. You know, folks who still want to come into town and, and catch all the action, um, we've got availability. The Big Ten women's tournament is sold out thanks in large part to Caitlin Clark, the generational star of the Iowa women's basketball team. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.